What's up everybody? Welcome back to another vlog. Me and Leon have just been to Ikea to pick up some furniture. Uh, picked up some stuff for the kitchen, picked up some stuff for the bedrooms. Uh, all will be disclosed later in this video as uh, it all gets put together. But uh, today is Easter egg Sunday, so uh, gonna get the first coat on some of the walls in the kitchen. Get the second coat on it when it's dry, which this paint does not take long to dry at all. Literally, I think about 30 minutes, 40 minutes and it weren't even tacky anymore, it would just dry. So, uh, not take too long to get a second coat on it, but obviously the little parts that I am painting with the little bits that I left last night and I needed a step, so, uh, so the actual part that, uh, the actual part that needs doing uh, for me to put the cupboards up can be second coated already. So when I get back, I'll be doing that uh, and hopefully getting a corner to edit this vlog uh, in time for it to actually go up. Well, yesterday's vlog, not this one. Cupboard built, four, cu four little cupboards built. Uh, very nice. Uh, I'm extremely happy with these. Uh, this is just going to be for like stuff like that. Uh, but I uh, haven't got time to put them on the wall. It's Zombie Sunday, so I'm going to go get that done. But I wanted to get them all built. Eventually, they are going to go on there, so the cupboard's going to come down and then across. But I am actually, as Courtney pointed out, now that I'm looking at them like this. I'm gonna give it a measure and see if we can actually fit another one of them there and then put four in the middle. See how that looks, cause that was your, oh, what you said. And I thought I'd measured it that it weren't gonna fit, but now looking at it, they will. They're a tiny bit smaller than I think Ikea's saying. I think they've rounded them up. I probably could go in the middle and all the way from edge at one. What, them, them in the middle? Yeah, well, obviously they're all. I want to measure it so there's a little gap at side. Yeah, because like I mean, two of them is not the same size as that, is it? No. So if we put four in the middle. Yeah. Measure and then one cupboard down. Ouch. Ooh, sharp nails. Yeah, I've got one in there. Oh, you're slapping. Oh, I can't cut with you and your fingers. Ow. They're really sore. I know. I know. I need cream on. Use but, yeah. but yeah, be all right, won't it? Yeah, in middle-ish. Yeah. Like. A compact thing. Yeah. Yeah. All right, thinking that to be fair, first best idea she've come up with this kitchen since last night. No, you stopped recording it, middle of me saying something then. Again, like Did usual. I? Yeah. I stopped recording middle of you saying, oh. Well, did you catch it? Yeah. When I said I've got the thing for me? Yeah. Why sound like when is it in the middle of me talking? Yeah. Oh. And your tippy toes. Because you do talk. And your tippy toes. <laughs> I'll carry it. Go on, then. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Easter egg Sunday is all over and I am getting straight to work on this wall. Getting it second coat so that the second coat can get dry and I can put me up some uh, some shelves. So let's get to it. Let's get to it. So I haven't got done anything at all right now. You can see the beginnings of me putting the wall plugs and the screws up for the cupboards. Right. Now, I don't have the tools necessary to check for electrical cabling. So I did it the old, an, an older fashioned way, I guess. And I took electrical things off of the wall to find where the wires came from. Now, there's two plugs down here, which I've already took off the wall and I, th I know where them wires, well, I forget how to phrase that. I thought I knew where them wires came from. Because the wire comes this way, somewhere. I, I don't think it does. I, I don't know. I, I checked the wiring, I pulled it, it, can't, it comes this way. So I was guessing that by the look of where the wire came from, and obviously you're not pulling diagonal, it come from this way, underneath the window, right? Clearly it doesn't. It comes down the wall from the light. But this this plug in the underfloor heating goes down. The wiring goes down. Like for this plug, the wiring literally comes from down here. So I thought there can't be any wiring up in the wall. 
because when I've looked at this light, the wiring comes from over here. So I didn't think there could be any wiring in this direction at all. Drilling away, first hole, perfect. Second hole, go halfway through, I hit an electrical cable. For what? I do not know. I've checked, uh, nothing's broke. I don't think, I checked the cable, best of my ability. It doesn't look like it's broke and nothing, everything still works down here. Nothing's tripped on a fuse. Uh, but when we go to sleep tonight, I am going to be turning off the outlets in the kitchen. Just in case. Because, you know, we don't want anything like that happening. But I am so confused at why the wire comes down the wall. When, when none of the cables look, especially like pan plug socket and the underfloor heating, None of the cables go up, like literally in the back box of this, the, the hole is down. And I pulled the wire, you can pull the wire, the wire is loose in the wall. So it came up, it came up from that direction. So I am just severely confused of how and why there were a cable in there, but I am lucky to be alive. You know, I, I'd say go six times out of 10, if you drill into an electrical wire, you were, uh, could get a pretty nasty shock. That's it. I'm, I guess I'm lucky to be alive, really. If I hadn't been watching what I was doing, I could have gone fully through an electrical cable and uh, not gone down very well. But uh, I don't know what to do. I'm going to investigate tomorrow. Uh, but I, I just haven't done anything. I haven't done anything at all. I went for a walk with Connie. We, we both went for a walk and... Uh, and that's about it, really. I just, I just don't even know what to say. I really, I really have just no idea. No idea what to say. Uh, but, but, yeah, I guess I'm lucky to be alive, really. So, after almost killing myself yesterday by drilling into an electrical cable, I think I've figured it out for tomorrow's vlog. Uh, help is on the way, dear. Help is on the way, dear. Uh oh. Oh dear. Well, after that, uh, no money going to the bank for my mum. That's all sorted now. Told Leon how to do it with different cards and so on and so forth. But that's a that's, that's different story. Uh, so I'm going to wrap this vlog up, guys. Uh, I finally, as I say, I finally found out a way to hopefully not electrocute myself while doing this. And I can actually get these shelves up. And that'll all be done in tomorrow's vlog. So you'll find out. Also, we started something new. We're going to be shrinking our vlogs down and putting them on TikTok, Instagram, and YouTube Shorts, all into a one-minute little compressed little video so that you guys can watch that instead of having to watch a full, you know, 10, 20-minute vlog. Um, just if you haven't got time, you know, you've got something to watch there. Uh, but then you can also come back to this one and watch this one. So, yeah, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. If you have enjoyed, please make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and ding dong that notification bell so you know when next upload. But apart from that, we'll see you tomorrow, guys. Peace. Peace. <laughs> see you tomorrow, guys.